yo what is going on guys what is up it's preacher man sports welcome back to another video and i got some breaking news considering the denver broncos they have just extended guard quinn miners to a four-year 80 million dollar deal and what do i got to say to this i fucking love this yes yes 1000 times yes you know quinn miners he's been one of the more underrated and underappreciated guards in the league and he's actually starting to get some media attention now thank god because this guy he's nasty on his blocks he's he's filthy you know he shuts down some of the top defensive linemen you know whenever quits jones faced him he didn't do good he got pancaked by him but he does some other jobs you know this year is going to be we're going to be facing tougher defensive lines you know the afc north that division is full of defensive line talent and um yeah Quinn Miners, I'm glad we don't have to worry about him this often because he was going to be a free agent. You know, he was our third round pick and can't lie. I got to give George Payton credit. You know, he knew what he was doing. Division three, um, division three um, guard and he's getting paid all that money. He's never been a pro bowler. Surprise. He should have been one last year. But, you know, old lineman pro, pro bowl is a popularity contest. So who gives a shit? But, um. Yeah, Quinn Miner is just a great guy, great player. I'm glad we don't have to worry about him in the offseason because in the offseason we have plenty of um, um, question marks for it. You know, we obviously got Garrett Bowles, who's like 31, 32. Do you bring him back? I wouldn't, but because of his age. The big one of Patrick Sutan, we gave him the fifth year option, but you might want to lock him up now so you don't have to worry. Uh, what else? Uh, Javante Williams, a free agent. This is his make or break year because he's not a bust because his rookie year, he was, he was awesome. But, you know, that rare knee injury he had, it kind of slowed him down last season. So he might not, it's a, it's a rumor that either him or Piron is going to get cut. But who else? I'm trying to think. Um, Baron Browning's a free agent. I'd honestly let him walk unless he comes back on a cheap deal. Um, and yeah, uh, DJ Jones is also a free agent, so, yeah. So that's not really much else to that, because, you know, I, Sean Payton and George Payton are so focused on the offensive line, because we literally threw all, money around for the offensive line, you know, Garrett Bowles, that extension a few years ago in 2020, um, there's Ben Powers, we paid him that money, um, we let Cushenberry go good because I guarantee he's not going to be that good in Tennessee. Um, we just paid there's we just paid Miners obviously best offensive lineman on our team, and then there's McGlinchey, who's overpaid, but he took a pay cut. So nice guy. He can, if he can fix his fix his um false stars, then I be, then I'll be and I would love the guy. But um yeah, besides that, so glad Qu Quinn Miners is back, so we don't have to worry about him. Dude is one of the best guards in the league. I'm sorry, you can call me biased all you want, but the the his his um the way he moves and his highlights and his um old line study on his film actually shows it. You know he he's nasty on his block. I think you know, I think the only problem with him is that he's a little too physical. Yeah, that's what happens when you're in a soft ass league. So fuck that. I guarantee you, ten years ago, he barely he wouldn't have really any penalty. That's what all the penalty is for: unnecessary roughness on blah blah. Big deal. One of the he's one of the best. You know, you can make the case that he's the best guard in our division. Like the Raiders, like their guards. they according to them, they're going to put Jackson Powers Johnson to guard, which I don't get. Uh, they got Dylan. They got um Dylan Parham at guard, who's not even good. Uh, the Chargers, you know, Z what Zion Johnson, who's a bust, and um, some other guy that no one cares about, and the Chiefs, like their guards, well, they have, I think, yeah, Joe Tooney. Well, Joe Tooney's good, actually. Never mind, could mind not, but Joe Tooney, and then there's um Trey Smith, I think. So, so yeah. So that's my case. Glad Quinn Miners is back. Let the belly breathe. But yeah, that's all I really wanted to say. Make sure you hit the like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to 
bring back more Bronco news, even though I'm Hollywood right now because I'm not gonna be talking to it because I just wanted a break from stuff. But I am gonna still be on YouTube. But yeah, Quinn Myers is back on a four year, $80 million extension. 45 million of it is guaranteed. So yeah, I will keep more coverage out and I will see you guys later. Peace out and as always, go Broncos.